Hey, Caitlin, they're going to get to see you as well. So Sunday is when Camp Commanders opens to fans. All eyes, of course, going to be on first round draft pick rookie quarterback Jaden Daniels. Today we heard from Daniels for the first time since training camp started on Wednesday. That's right. You should know WUSA 9 is the official television station of the Washington Commanders, which means you get unmatched access to the players and the coaches, not just during training camp, but all year long. All right, let's go out there live to Chick Hernandez and Wisdom Martin at Commanders Park in Ashburn. So guys, I mean, a ton of excitement <laughs> around Jaden Daniels, but when you talk to him today, he's trying to take some of the focus off of himself. He, he is, Adam, but, but before we get to, <laughs> to that, because us two together is going to be an issue <laughs> uh, all season yeah. long. We're doing the pregame show, okay, because, because on his notepad yes. it, says, it says Chick, as if he has to remember my name. Well, <laughs> what well, am I know, dealing with here? You know, uh, anytime you have a scenario, Adam, at the moment where somebody has to take the last shot, yeah. you know there's going to be some issues, uh, okay? Mm. Who, uh, who, runs, who is the offense running through? Yeah. So yeah, that means well, we that got means trouble right here. one and trouble two. That's what I said. That means you, you guys just won't <laughs> yes, stop I'm, talking. I'm taking the snap. <laughs> yeah, right. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. So it's a half hour of just me and Wisdom <laughs> chatting it up. Uh, yes, uh, as you said, Jaden Daniels uh, is uh, the, the man of the hour, the man of the minute for this franchise. Uh, this is the rookie this morning in Ashburn at the Commander's Compound as he gets ready with the burgundy and gold. Uh, look, I have to tell you, by the way, we've been rather lucky uh, with the weather so far through the first three days of camp. The defense, though, I will tell you, they got the better of the offense today. It's another spirited practice. Two things I noticed. Mm -hmm. When Daniels wants to tuck it and run, by the way, there aren't many who are going to catch him, but they don't want him running the ball too much. What they do want is a teammate who, even though he comes in with a ton of buzz, is going about his business. It's not about him, and his reasoning is simple. If the vet, veteran leadership that we have isn't doing, isn't doing that, so why, why do I have the, the right? Why do I feel like I have the right to do it? So, I mean, but that's just me. It's not, I'm never going to put myself out there in the spotlight to think I'm bigger than anybody, better than anybody. Um, everybody's equal on the field, and you got to go out there and uh, compete and show it each and every day, and that's what DQ preaches. We have an effective plan for him, and Jaden's the type of guy that wants to go nail it in terms of each day, each marker to go. But uh, we're really going to stay true to this. You know, we have a really good plan. And like, what's fun about it is like, he's the type of person that wants to nail this part. So we're just not too far down the line um, of where we're headed and staying right in the moment with him. That helps. And uh, he's really doing a good job. But um, with the team, it, it's we're going into our third day. And so I think we all remember that because you want to look down the line so much. but. He's doing outstanding. Yeah. So what Dan Quinn is saying is just stay right here. Right. Do, don't think ahead. Right. We're going day by day. It's fine, just like you do uh, during the season. You got a chance to catch a little bit of the practice. Right, right, exactly. And it was it was exciting. It was precise. So it, it's different than the practices have been in the past. So this is clearly a new era. No question. A new era. And you know what else? Uh, you talked about Jaden Daniels. A lot, obviously, a lot of conversation about Jaden. He's a big deal. We know that he's the future of the franchise. But Somebody's got to protect him. <laughs> Somebody's got to protect him. You got to keep him upright, and that falls to the offensive line. And that offensive line, well, it's been completely revamped. And, and part of that revamping, part of that change, is the man in the middle, the center, Tyler Badias. He came from the Dallas Cowboys, and he talked about he, how he's got to develop some chemistry with the offensive lineman, the other offensive lineman, as, as well as some chemistry with the quarterback. And like everybody else, so far, he likes what he's seen from the quarterback, Jaden Daniels. Jaden, he's, he's doing great. I mean, he's he's continuing to keep learning in the playbook as everyone else is too. I mean, obviously we have a it's a it's a new it's a new team. It's a new culture. There's so many newness to it. So we're just gelling it all together and bringing it in as one. And and you know how we talk about in our meetings, we're an extension of one another. You know, and and this is when you're on the field, it's all eleven. They got music going in I the mean, background. What is going on back here? I, as part of practice, we thought practice was, was over. Was that your limousine? Yeah, they're coming to get me, so okay. we got to hurry up and wrap this okay. up. So, right. so real quick about um, Tyler. Dallas Cowboys started 41 out of 51 games, and out of the 2,279 pass plays, he only allowed four sacks. That's impressive. That's a lot of yeah. plays where he did not allow a sack on a pass. Yeah, Tyler Biotis is a great talker, yes. by the way, as you saw. And yes. uh, yeah, he's got a little he's got a little uh, chip on his shoulders. That's right. fun. Yeah. Uh, so as I mentioned at the top, uh, you and I will be hosting a, a pregame show. Yes. First uh, time here for WSA 9. And uh, 
Quite frankly, I'm frightened. <laughs> as, as you okay, I'm just frightened. <laughs> I'm just going to say right now. I'm absolutely frightened. You, Stop laughing, you, Simone. Hey, this ain't funny. I'm this just is saying, my career on the okay, line. I've also got my notepad, so you, I mean, you're just surrounded with See? wisdom's got his. I got you. Do you, have got Adam's, you. do you have Adam's name on your pad? I, I've got to add this, though, guys, because I was with each of you <laughs> last summer on each of your okay. first days mm -hmm. on WSA 9's air. Right. And the way that the fans of this team embraced both of you, it was yeah. two different days that I met each of you independently. I mean, you guys were signing more autographs and taking more selfies than some of the, the people on the squad were. So to have the two of you together with the fans and with the team, I mean, y'all ain't getting any work done. Let's just let's just set that aside well, right now. Look, it's, look, it's, look it's, 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 that compliment started out so good, and then yeah, yeah, y'all not getting any it's, work done. No, Cle it. Clearly, it's the smartest move that WSA Nine Brass has Absolutely. ever made. Absolutely, uh -huh. ever uh -huh. right. in the history of probably in the history of this market. Probably. Yeah, okay. there you I don't think so. We're looking Love forward it. to it. The yes, Washington yes. Post writers are, are quoting that right now uh -huh. as they uh, as they, they uh, head towards their deadline. Who cares? So. Yeah. Who cares? There you go. There who you cares? Go. All right. Listen, don't forget about us, though. Chicken Wisdom Never. coming up. Wisdom and Chick. Wisdom and Chick. Uh -oh. That's right. Commander's kickoff starting in September at 1130 on Sunday. Sundays. We're going to be there. We're going to figure out who's going to whose name. His name is going to be first no. because that's the way it goes in the al alphabet. alphabet. I like yes. that. Yes. C to W. This is the problem solved. Hey, I've already got my TV yeah. set. Adam and I are ready. Sunday's 1130. We'll yeah. be watching. And you'll, you guys will be back with us at 5 o'clock. I don't believe Our producer you. is telling us to shut this yeah, down, so we're like, just going to clip like, your nope. mics and we're going to move on <laughs> with the show. <laughs> okay. Uh, thanks, guys. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Toodaloo. All right. So make sure you keep it here on WUSA 9. Again, for all things Commanders, every day of training camp, we're going to have more exclusive content on the new at five and six and as we were just talking about mark your calendars for the WUSA 9 fan zone at Camp Commanders. We'll be at Camp Sunday August 4th, Tuesday August 6th so stop by the tent to meet members of our team and learn how you can become a Commanders insider with WUSA 9. We'll be out there from 8 to 1 both days so come on by and say hello. It's gonna be a ton of fun you saw it there. All right.